Great to see you heaving and happily hauling. It won't be long till you are back. We're on our way. We have our fare down to the station. The engines are on there. Every day there's so much to do. Hey, Thomas, we know that you'll pull through. Steamworks friends to everyone. Great to see the steam team are happily hooping the strongest engines, hauling all those tons. We're on our way. We have our fare down to the station. The engines are on there. To know you're coming, we're counting on you. Every day our mail gets through. We're on our way. We have our fare down to the station. The engines are on there. Every day there's so much to do. Hey Thomas, we know the jumble food. At harvest time, the air is filled with the smell of fresh fruit and vegetables. The engines happily deliver their loads to market. But one day, Mr. Wang swelled down Toby's line. Percy was delivering a load of fresh tomatoes. Suddenly, he felt a big bump. Bless my buffers, what was that? The guard put out the warning flags while Percy's driver expected the tracks. It looks like the earth's crumbling, Percy. We must tell Sir Topham Hatt. Percy popped back as fast as he could. I've got important news. The tracks on Toby's line are wobbly. Hmm, <laughs> old and wobbly, just like Toby. That's not news. Can't stop to listen to your silly chaka. Gordon never listens to me. Next, he spoke to the back controller. Sir, sir. Ugh, not now, Percy. Thomas, you are to collect the prize ball. He is at the farm on Toby's branch line. But those tracks are wobbly. They are safe enough. Goodbye, Percy. Nobody never listens to me. Thomas was carefully chugging through the rain. He had collected the farmer's ball and was on his way back. The rain had made the tracks more wobbly than ever. Suddenly, there was a deep rumbling sound. Thomas's driver applied the brakes, but it was too late. Wow! Oof! Cinders and ashes, we're stuck. And they were. Late that night, Thomas still hadn't returned. Percy was worried. Thomas is in trouble. Wobbly wheels. Percy Funnel. Please, can we find Thomas? Right away, Percy. Percy 
Lucy was nervous, but his lamp shone brightly in the dark. The tracks creaked and wobbled, but Percy pressed on. Percy, it's you! Thomas was very happy to see his friend. I'll have you out of here in no time. Percy puffed and pulled and pulled and puffed and finally Thomas and his driver were free. Oh, thank you very much. I'm glad to be useful. It was dawn before the tracks woods cleared. Then Percy and Thomas made their way back home. Thomas is here. Percy saved the day. I'm sorry, Percy. Perhaps in future we should take more attention to listening to your advice. Percy was pleased. 